Leaving teenagers safe on the roads, car crashes kill more teens in the U.S. than anything else, and a local organization is trying to change that. 10 News reporter Jessica Jewell gives us a look at the program that stopped by Christiansburg High School today using dramatic visuals in hopes of making a dramatic difference. Christiansburg High School knows the pain of losing a classmate all too well, still mourning the death of 16-year-old Ashlyn Poole. She was thrown from the passenger seat of a car and killed last July. Investigators say the driver was going more than double the speed limit. Now organizations like Youth of Virginia Speak Out or Yovaso are trying to make sure students never have to deal with a loss like that again. And this one's all about crash reconstruction. They're hoping with a wrecked car and an iPad, they can create change. Students scan QR codes attached to various items. No way that person's about to. That takes them to a video showing real life consequences of unsafe driving and passenger behaviors. That's crazy. It kind of scares you like you can literally die from that or like not paying attention, being on your phone while driving. It's just a really interactive way to help them to see, you know, that it can happen to me, that they're not invincible. Yovaso's Casey Taylor says it all comes back to bad decision making. That's why this program teaches students the consequences. It may be that you go to jail. It may be that you have community service. You might get this or that, um, but you could also, you know, lose your life or impact someone else and they can lose their life and then impact their family. Don't be distracted. Don't text and drive because it can't only cost your life, but other people's. In Christiansburg, Jessica Jewell, 10 News, working for you.